In this video, we will be describing the non-contact encoder. This device is used to measure the rotational speed of a DC motor. A little bit about how it works. The system relies on an infrared sensor. The sensor would emit infrared light and detect any reflected light. If a reflection is detected, the sensor would have a digital output of 1. Otherwise, the output is 0. The infrared sensor is connected to the digital pin of an Arduino. Whenever the output changes from a 1 to a 0, the Arduino records this change as a revolution. The entire system you see before you is run by a 9 volt battery. We will now have a demonstration of the non-contact encoder. As you can see here, we have attached this disk to the Quanzer cube. The cube will allow the disk to rotate using this VI. For testing purposes, the VI displays the RPM of the cube. We will be using 5 volts for this demo. All right. I've turned the device on and placed it steadily above the rotating disk. Each time the infrared sensor emits light at the white streak, the output will be a 1 due to the light reflected. When this output becomes a 0, the Arduino will record this change as a revolution. After 15 seconds, the recorded revolutions will be multiplied by 4 and displayed on the LCD screen, as you can see before you. You must keep your hand steady to ensure accurate readings. So we saw the RPM on the, uh, on the LCD was 1108, and the RPM displayed was 1127. There's a slight discrepancy in the accuracy, but this is how this device works. Thank you.